Hello. Konnichiwa. Let's practice writing some Japanese characters. We will show you how to write some kanji characters with a brush and pen. There are three written character sets currently used in Japan kanji, hiragana, and katakana. Kanji originally came from China, and hiragana and katakana are Japanese phonetic alphabets born in Japan. Japanese is mostly written from top to bottom, left to right. Ki means tree in Japanese. However, it also reads as moku or boku. Mokuyobi is a common word with this kanji and means Thursday. Also, when you write with a brush, there are many rules to follow, such as starting and ending straight lines with 45 degrees angle. This kanji character was born based on the shape of a tree. There are many kanji characters that are shaped based on the shape of items. Does this look like a tree? Onna is the character for woman in Japanese. It also reads jo, nyo, and me. Jo o is an example word with this kanji and means queen. An interesting fact of this kanji is that the cursive style of kanji was simplified and it became me. In kiragana. When you write this kanji, make sure you stop at the end of the first and third lines, but let go of your brush or pen at the end of the second line. Sakana is the character for fish in Japanese. It also reads uo and gyo. Gyokai is an example word with this kanji and means seafood. There are many kanji characters with this sakana as part of the kanji, about 200. For example, the kanji for maguro tuna, sake salmon, and saba mackerel all have sakana in it. This kanji is also shaped like a fish. Think of the top part as the dorsal fin, middle part as the body, and the bottom part as the tail. This kanji is made with 11 strokes. Try not to make the box part too big or too wide. And the box is not completely square, the bottom gets a little slim. The first dot out of four is facing the other way, so watch out. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you learned some Japanese kanji characters and some interesting facts. It is written and voiced by a Japanese calligrapher, Kishu.